licensed sports book in the Delaware Valley today. Action News reporter Maggie Kent is live at the casino in Fishtown with a look at what live sports betting could mean for the casino and for the city. Maggie. And hopefully that means a lot of extra revenue coming in. There is big competition across the bridge because New Jersey has had sports betting for quite a while now. But now Pennsylvania getting in on that action, especially here at Sugar House Casino. This is the line of gentlemen waiting to get up to the betting windows. There are betting windows, there are kiosks, and of course there are big screen TVs showing the games. Three, two, one. With a rush of confetti, a new era of entertainment is ushered into Philadelphia. Sports betting officially up and running at Sugar House Casino on Delaware Avenue. The first bet fitting. Bet on the Philadelphia Eagles, plus 13. With six betting windows, six kiosks, you can bet on major league and college sports. And there's likely more to come. Basketball, we'll have uh, football, we'll have hockey, we'll have baseball. Um, and we're, we're actually right now doing analysis to see what other sports we can add, looking at uh, the demographic of Philadelphia and what they want. The Supreme Court ruling legalized sports betting across the country back in May, and each state had to come up with their own set of laws surrounding the game. After months of prep work, PA is now in competition with New Jersey. To bring these tax revenues that sports betting is going to generate to this side of the river and to the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania. And players are eager to cash in on the action. I like um, Seattle on the money line. I'm a winner, man, so I come to get this money. Of course, that is a goal for everyone here. These kiosks must be 21 to place the bets here. They are active, they are live, but you still have to come in person. Sugar House Casino has an online betting website for New Jersey residents that has not been established yet here in Pennsylvania. Still working out the kinks in the law on that, but it is hopeful that that will be there in about 2019. Everybody's obviously excited here. Live at the casino. So, um, Sugar House Casino in Philadelphia, I think, becomes the first casino in Pennsylvania to offer legal sports betting. And it should be a boost um, for the city. And it, my opinion on it is this. Now, when I went there on Saturday, because I went there Saturday and Sunday, Saturday wasn't too bad. But when I went there Sunday morning, it was a madhouse. I mean, you had lines all over the place. And the thing is... And it's going to take time for it to get organized, but it's it's not like Delaware Park. Delaware Park, they got three floors of sports betting. You got three floors, and they have kiosks on almost every floor, and they have windows on every floor. And the difference between, again, is that Delaware has the slips that you fill out. You just circle in the dot, the number, take it up to the counter, and then they just put it into the machine and it'll come out so yes Pennsylvania just got started so it's likely to improve but I'm gonna wait and see if Harris Philadelphia and what they do but like I said it's good for the city I just think that they need more floors for it they need to have their own separate floor for just sports betting I don't know if they have a second floor for sports betting or not but that's what I think they should do I know Harris in Chester, PA? They got three or four floors for so. You know we'll see how that goes. I don't know when Harris will get their sports thing, you know. Get it going, but it should be going going in um, around 2019, which is a few weeks away. But um, all in all, I didn't win anything with it. Um, that's just um. My opinion it was crazy on Sunday. It had like a hundred people in line and six windows. I think you have to call out your parlays, and I think you know they should have at least little cards like Delaware do. And I think the Delaware Lottery owns the Delaware casinos, and they own that. So I think if the PA Lottery could get into that, could get into the sports betting thing, I think it will be a lot better and a whole lot easier. You know, because Delaware Lottery got theirs. I think PA Lottery should get into that. And I think they will get into that. So, um, we'll see what happens. But tell me what you think about um, 
sports betting in Pennsylvania, the Sugar House Casino. Um, tell me how you feel about it and how you, what you like about it and what you don't like about it. Like, comment, and subscribe.